good thing about working underground is it doesn't matter if it's day or night, it's all the same. And um, it's a good team environment. Everyone relies so heavily on everyone else. Most of the time what we're doing in underground mining is just to, just to keep the mining going where, they, where they're planning for it to go. Because you're in a dark, dark hole and, and you're four or five kilometres underground and you're just working in a black coal seam, everything looks the same. You know, if someone spins you around, you don't know which way is north, which way is south. So we set up under a known point. Uh, we know its coordinate position. We, um, we're sighting to a, another known coordinate position. We're able to, like a protractor, turn off the angle to, uh, to know which way we need to head. So we just turn 90 degrees and then we're able to put a line in that roof there on that wall and we can let the miner proceed through there and keep on mining that way and we know where we are in space. Uh, we're in a totally coal environment. We've got, uh, we've got coal above us, coal below us and coal left and right of us. One of the oddities of working underground is, uh, is that people might not understand, of course, you can't look at people in the eyes because you blind them so we're forever underground pointing the light at about someone's chest. Let's go Les. We're out of here. Job's done for the day. Weekend. Beer o'clock. Another hard day at the office.